It's a loyalty oath to America. Are you now, or have you ever been? I thought it was a joke at first. Moreau signed it. Moreau signed it? If you don't sign this, are you and I a target? If I don't sign it, they'll fire me. Ten seconds. Ready on camera, Glenn. Good evening. Any man who protects communists is not fit to wear that uniform. You can't convict people by rumor and hearsay and in your end note. Are my children going to be asked who denounce me? Are they going to be judged on what their father was labeled? I see a chain reaction that has no end. Charges were in a sealed envelope. Nobody saw them. Wouldn't you guess that the people who have seen the contents of that envelope might have who? a better idea of what makes someone a danger to his country? Who? Or do you think who it should just be people, you sir? that decides? Who are the people? Are they elected? Are they appointed? Is it you? I've searched my conscience, and I can't find any justification for this. Our next show is going to be about Senator McCarthy. We're going to go right at him. We will not walk in fear one of another. This is no time for men who oppose Senator McCarthy's methods to keep silent. Mr. Edward R. Murrow has made repeated attacks upon me and those fighting communists. Somebody's going to go down. They're going to get audited this year. Not me, you. McCarthy wants April 6th. I will not be deterred. He's going to come after me. You understand the position you're putting us in? Let's walk very carefully through these next few moments. Why don't you just fire me, Bill? Go after Joe Kennedy. We'll pay for it. Tomorrow is a symbol, the leader, and the cleverest of the jackal pack engaged in propaganda for communist causes. Okay, fellas, here we go. We might as well go down swinging. We're gonna go with the story, because the terror is right here in this room. Ten seconds. Five. We cannot defend freedom abroad by deserting it at home. Good night and good luck.